everyone knows the saying, you get what you pay for, or the best bang for your buck, you know, or similar ones. Now, most of you that shoot ARs, you've also heard of Bear Creek Arsenal or BCA. There is also a saying about opinions. They are like uh, something, and everybody has one. Now, BCA is undisputed for being affordable. Now, after that, everybody has their own opinion. Me, I always tend to go with the proof is in the pudding, or as I always say on my videos, it is what it is. I like nothing more than QPC, quality, performance, and cost, or uh, best bang for your buck, as a lot of folks say. Now, recently, BCA came out with their new Cold Hammer Forge, or CHF, barrels and upper. The only real question is, is what kind of QPC are we going to get with BCA's CHF? What can we expect from their CHF 556 upper? It's pretty kiss, guys. Only one way to find out. Let's put it to the test, see what we can get for groups, and have some fun. Nice. Nice. Send another one. I'm Drew Case. Welcome to Beyond Seclusion, where I only give you my honest opinion, and it is what it is. Now, I don't think too many folks are going to argue the BCA is not one of the sexiest or best-looking ARs around. That is really not their intent. Now, most are only really concerned with functionality and reliability, and of course, the QPC, and a lot of times, the cost. Okay, let's just put a nice optic on this CHF upper, uh, a quality optic. We're going to put it in a match custom lower with a custom trigger. We're hopefully going to eliminate everything as far as accuracy other than the barrel or the upper itself. And, you know, get it zeroed, get the barrel seasoned, and see what we can get for groups with a variety of ammo. And while we're doing that, we'll see how it performs and its reliability with the different ammo. Okay, real quick here, the setup that I've got the BCA on, I've got a PSA custom lower here with a trigger tech, a custom trigger. It's awesome. I absolutely love that. And then for the optic, I've got Athlon's 4.5 to 30 by 56. Really nice optic. I got a primary arms um, mount. This is the same optic that I used when I reviewed Springfield's Saint Edge, uh, the ATC Elite you know, attack driver. So we have accounted, I think, for about every uh, variability here other than the ammo, the shooter, and the barrel. Okay, real quick, just so you can see what I'm seeing as far as our picture. There's the sight picture that we're getting at 100 yards. Okay, this is just to show you how I'm firing off these five-shot groups. I'm firing them off, and then I'm taking... The gun inside for 15 minutes, letting it cool down to room temp, and then repeating. Definitely, definitely likes the heavier bullet. Right, let's just run down and take a look at the groups and see what we got.
Okay, so this is some of the groups getting it zeroed with the AAC, the full metal jacket. And then we start in here with our five shot groups. I can't remember who is who. Um, there's actually two shots there. Yeah, that's that's not a bad group. Um, if you got rid of the flyer, eh, not the best. I'm going to say I think this is the best one because there's five shots. So we got two groups of two touching. And then here, you know, I mean, not bad. Uh, we're spreading out there. Again, it's a little, bitter, a little bigger than an MOA. This one really kind of spread out a little bit. Wasn't liking that one super. Um, remember when I got those two, I was like, all right. But again, you know, kind of about the same. This one really kind of spread out a little bit. What I want to do is maybe put group these up and do another five shots of each. See, like, if this will stay consistent um, and see what we get. Now, now, one thing I had noticed when I was zeroing was kind of some, in, you know, a shot here and then a shot over there. And I think, okay, well, I flinched on that. And then I'd get a shot here. And then I'd get another shot over here. So I'm not sure if, you know, the harmonics of the barrel, um, the gas block is really, really tight in there. It's close to the grip. And I'm not sure if at different points when it warms up, if it's actually touching the grip. Because it, we've got like maybe a millimeter um, of space between the two. And so I don't know if that's playing a part here with, with some of the groupings. Okay. So here's our final groups after coming back and doing another five rounds of each of them. What I did was I took the gun inside and set it on the register for five minutes. I had the timer go off, promptly picked it up after five minutes. So it cooled it off. I, I think, you know, the groupings and what we're seeing, it was very consistent. You know, that's not, that's not bad. If you get rid of the flyers, that's actually a pretty solid group. That one's awesome because there's five shots. Uh, it doubled up here. I think it was there and there. So we had one, two, three, four, five on the second round. There, you know, if you got rid of that flyer, that is a really solid group. And that one's not so great. That one's another pretty decent one. Spread out here a little bit. This one really surprised me. Um, boy, that could almost be the winner. And I know uh, because I just shot that one. That's the Hornady Frontier, the 55 grain boat to a hollow point match. And I actually bought that in bulk a long time ago. I always have great luck with that, which is interesting because I did not like this 55 grain full metal jacket. And then this is another one that's a pretty solid group. That's at IMI. So, you know, there it is, guys. You decide what you think. I want to bang on a little steel here before I call this good. Okay, we're just going to have a little fun here. We're going to reach up on the hill at 600 yards, or sorry, 400 yards, and uh, give this a go. Nice. Okay. Hang on just a sec. Nice. <laughs> okay, reaching up there at four and five hundred yards, guys. That wasn't me. Hey, folks, are you enjoying this review? If you are, help support the channel. Hit that subscribe button. This helps more than just about anything. It's simple, quick, costs you nothing. Not a zip, zero, nothing. So hit that button. Keep the reviews coming. Now, if you have not visited my webpage, you should for many reasons, like my discount codes for some of the great companies, including ammo, guns, and gear. I have a list of the companies that I use the most and recommend. At the bottom of the page is a list of current discount codes ranging anywhere from 5 to 15% off anything in your cart. Now, you should be interested in my crazy, stupid deals subscription. Here are some of the deals that I found in the past. And when I find these, I now have the ability to share in an instant with everyone that subscribes. And I blast them out in an email as soon as I find them it costs you nothing unsubscribe at any time i have saved folks hundreds even thousands of dollars don't take my word read the comments it works it's awesome and it costs nothing
If you follow my channel and you shop on Amazon, you can help support and keep the reviews coming by going on to Amazon through my link. Anything and everything you purchase by doing so helps support the channel. You can literally buy toilet paper through my link and it helps support the channel and the reviews. Simply save the link to your phone or your computer and shop as you always do. And check out my highly rated online courses. They come with a 30 day money back guarantee. You got nothing to lose. Literally thousands have found them helpful. Read the reviews and see for yourself. Here and check out the cooking tips page. There are some awesome recipes on there, good food, and it can literally save you thousands of dollars a year. Thanks for your help. Couldn't do it without you. Nice. Send another one. Nice. Three for three. Three for three. Four for four. Four for four. Nice. Nice. That's setting the bar high, guys. Nice. <laughs> Way to go. That was pretty impressive. That was my 12-year-old daughter. That is her second time shooting a rifle. Uh, between her and my wife, they set the bar really high guys and it makes saying it is what it is you decide what you think very fitting now i'm reviewing a tactical light for olight got up really early this morning and was able to still reach up there at 500 yards little bonus footage check this out hit there's a coon there's eyes up there okay now we gotta wait for the smoke let's go four there we go That's at four and 500 yards, guys. Okay, let's just see how fast we can get them off at 400 here before the sun comes up too much. Yeah, the smoke. <laughs> I gotta wait for all that smoke to clear. There you go, guys. It doesn't get a whole lot better than that. Um, proof is in the pudding. You decide what you think. We reached out 500 yards with a hundred. There you have it, guys. It is what it is. You decide what you think. Does, Does it have the QPC? That's up to you to decide. I hope you enjoyed the video, found it helpful. If so, help support the channel. Hit that subscribe button, guys. Really, hit the subscribe button. It helps more than anything else. Be sure to like and comment. Until next time, happy shooting. Remember, educate our young people to shooting and gun safety. And every time we're on the range, every time we're doing anything with firearms these days, everybody's watching us, so that makes us ambassadors for the Second Amendment. Please be a good ambassador. Be a safe and responsible gun owner.